Hello guys, how are you? Today we are talking about invertebrates, animals that are invertebrates. In the last lesson, we talked about vertebrates, which means animals that have backbones. But today, let's talk about animals without a backbone. Animals without a backbone, and they are called invertebrates. They are called what? In vertebrates, so animals that do not have bone are called invertebrates. Number two, they always have soft bodies. Most of the invertebrates always have soft bodies, and they also have a hard covering that protect them from the predators. That protect them from the predator. Number three, they do not have bones. So, they do not grow big. In the last lesson, I told you that vertebrates always have bones and they grow so big. Now, these invertebrates, they do not have bones and they do not grow so big. So, we have more of invertebrates than vertebrates. We have more of invertebrates than vertebrates in the world. And we have four groups of invertebrates. Vertebrates. We have how many groups? Four groups of invertebrates. And these are the what? Groups of invertebrates. We have the sea jellies. We have the sea jellies. They live in the ocean and they have soft body. We have the worms. Worms live in the soil and they have long and soft bodies. Then we have the group of mollusks. We have the octopores. We have the snails. They are examples of mollusks. They have soft body but they have a, a hard cover outside their body that protect them. Now number four, we have the what? The group of arthropods. The arthropods are the largest group of vertebrates. The arthropods, they are the largest group of vertebrates and we have the spider and the crabs and their, and their body parts are jointed together. So these are the group of invertebrates. I hope you understand. If you have a question, you can what, send a message to me in the WhatsApp. I will answer all your questions. Thank you.